supermarkets have many dietary supplements, and products, that claim to boost the immune system. But while it may sound easy, strengthening the immune system, is actually much harder, than you think, and for good reason. Your immune system is incredibly complex. It needs to be strong, and mature enough, to fight a variety of illnesses, and infections, but it is not powerful enough, to overreact unnecessarily, and cause allergies, and other, autoimmune disorders. To function in such a delicate equilibrium, the immune system is tightly, controlled by multiple inputs. But despite its complexity, there are everyday lifestyle habits, you can focus on, to help give your immune system what it needs, to fight off an infection, or illness. Here are 5 science-backed ways, to ensure your immune system has everything it needs, to function optimally, as well as, why you shouldn't rely on supplements, to boost your immune system. Maintain a healthy diet. As with most things in your body, a healthy diet, is key to a strong immune system. This means making sure you eat plenty of vegetables, fruits, legumes, whole grains, lean protein and healthy fats. In addition to providing your immune system, the energy it needs, a healthy diet can help ensure you're getting sufficient amounts, of the micronutrients that play a role in maintaining your immune system, which include the following. Vitamin B6, found in chicken, salmon, tuna, bananas, green vegetables, and potatoes, with the skin. Vitamin C, found in citrus fruit, including oranges, and strawberries, as well as tomatoes, broccoli and spinach. Vitamin E, found in almonds, sunflower, and safflower oil, sunflower seeds peanut butter and spinach. Since experts believe that, your body absorbs vitamins, more efficiently from dietary sources, rather than supplements, the best way to support your immune system, is to eat a well-balanced diet. Regular Exercise Physical activity is not only a muscle building, and stress reliever but also an important part of a health, and healthy immune system. One way to improve immune function, is to increase the overall circulation. This makes it easier for immune cells, and other molecules, that fight infections to move around the body. In fact, studies have shown that, moderate exercise for 30 minutes, a day can stimulate the immune system, even with strenuous exercise. Therefore, it is important to focus on staying active, and doing regular exercise. Hydration. Water plays many important roles in your body, including helping the immune system. The body fluids of the circulatory system, called lymph, carry important immune cells around the body, to fight infection, but most of them are water. Dehydration slows lymphatic movement and may weaken immunity. Even when you are not exercising, or sweating, you are constantly losing water due to breathing, urine, and defecation. Try to replace lost water, with usable water, to support the immune system. This starts with knowing how much water you really need. Get a lot of sleep. Sleep certainly doesn't feel like an active process, but when you're not awake, your body has many important activities, even if you're not aware of it. For example, important molecules to fight infection are formed during sleep. According to a study, people who do not get enough sleep, are more likely to get sick, after being exposed to a virus, such as a cold. To give your immune system, the best chance of fighting an infection, or illness, it's important to know how much sleep, you should get each night, and what steps to take, if you are suffering, as a result of sleeplessness. Minimizing stress. It is important to understand how stress affects your health, whether it occurs quickly, or accumulates over time. This includes its effects on the immune system. During stressful stages, especially frequent, and long-lasting chronic stress, your body responds to stress responses. 
This dress response suppresses the immune system and increases the likelihood of infection or illness. Stress varies from person to person. Given the potential effects it can have on your health, it is important to know how to recognize stress and means of reducing or managing it and whether it's deep breathing, mediation, prayer, or exercise. You should also be familiar with activities that will help you relieve stress. Last words about supplements. First of all, there is no evidence that dietary supplements actually help improve the immune system and the likelihood of fighting infections and illnesses. Moreover, unlike drugs, dietary supplements are not regulated or approved by the FDA. For example, if you think that large amounts of vitamin C can help prevent you from getting sick, think again. When looking for ways to boost your immune system, it's a good idea to stick to the lifestyle choices mentioned in this video, rather than relying on labels. Thank you for watching. If you like the video don't fail to like, share, and subscribe for more videos.